Hello everyone, welcome back to the YouTube channel of Developers and Coders Club. Today we are here to discuss the problem C of distant context of code forces that was at 6 for round and rated for division 2. So this is an inductive problem and in this we have to find out the position of king which is placed in the uninterim side chessboard and what we can do, we can ask queries to uh, system and we cannot ask more than 3 questions. Okay? And in each question, what you will be, what will we get as a response that, like if you ask for three and seven, for three and seven, if you ask questions, then we will get that what is the minimum count of steps that this king need to do to reach this cell. And as you can see that for this cell, one, two, three, and four, four steps is needed for king. So we will get four as your response. 3 and 7 so as you can see that the size of this grid is 10 to the power 9 into 10 to the power 9 this is the maximum size of grid but we can only ask more than mm, 3 questions we cannot ask more than 3 questions so what can be the possible approach for this for that just think that if we ask for 1 and 1 then what can be the possible output for this person uh, 1 2, 3 and 4. So if king is placed here, then for 1 and 1 we will get 4 as our response. But uh, how to determine that this will be the place for that? So for that consider that on how many cells, from how many cells we get 4 for reaching this cell. What I want to say? That how many cells are there in this grid? from which if king is placed on that cell then 4 steps is needed to king to reach this cell like uh, if we consider this cell then 1 2 3 and 4 if we consider this cell then 1 again 2 3 and 4 if we consider this cell 1 2 3 and 4 and if we consider this cell 1 2 3 and 4 and for this set 1 and 3 this is coming only in 3 so let me mark down these all values for this that is 4 this 4 4 4 and for this 1 2 3 and 4 for this also 4 and for this 4 y was 1, 2, 3 and 4 and if you consider for this then that will be 4, 4, 4 and you can try string on this like that will be 3, 3, 3, 3 you can check these all so what are you getting that if we ask for 1 and 1 like we get a uh, well age or response then what we can see that if uh, we consider for this cell then we are getting four age or response so we can say that our king will be placed either in five or king can be placed in all these cells if we are getting four age or response so we can say that whatever well is we are getting or king can be placed in one okay sorry well and one well two well and well or that can be placed in well one two well and well am i right what i want to say that this is over one and well okay sorry this well is well plus one because we are getting 4 age or response because uh, on three person only 4 steps is needed for that so I am increasing our value with a plus 1 so this will be 1 comma well this will be well comma 1 and this will be well comma well so kin can be placed in 1 well to well well and this to this so as of now we have asked the one question we have two more chances 
to ask the question. So for that, what we will do? We know that our king will be placed in these cells. Now what we will do? We will ask for this cell. We will ask for 1, now 5, comma 1. This will be this cell. Now for this, what can be the possible response? We know that our king is not placed any person like that. Or will, that will be placed only these cells. Okay. So for this, uh, response will be 1. For this, 2, 3, 4. Now for this, 1, 2, 3, 4. For this, 1, 2, 3, 4. For this, 1, 2, 3, 4. And same for this. For these all, that will be 4. And for this, that will be 1, 2, 3. Now, what we can say from this, that uh, whatever response we are getting, and same we will ask for this 1 comma 5 then just think that we are getting will 1 as our response for this and will 2 as our response for this now if will 2 if will 2 is less than will 1 that means if will 2 is less than will 1 that means our king is placed on these cells and what will be the position of king that will be 1 plus will 2 comma well and this is 5 which we have got in the first or first question and this is well 2 which we got from this and same if uh, well 1 that is response for this query that is less than well 2 then what we will do that uh, our king will be placed on this is 5 1 our king will be placed on well comma 1 plus well 2 because well is this 5 and 1 plus well 2 that means okay, sorry well 1 because we are getting well 1 as response of this one so well 1 for this cell that is 1 so 5 comma 2 that is this index and for this that is 5 comma 3 so what we will do that first of all we will ask for 1 comma 1 we are getting well as your response for this now we will ask for 1 comma v for this we are getting vl2 and for vl comma 1 we are getting vl3 now what we will do we will first check that if vl2 is less than vl3 if that is then what we will do that our king is placed on uh, if vl2 is less than vl3 that means this is our condition that means our king is placed on vl2 comma well and else that means this is your condition then our king will be placed on well comma well 3 but uh, there is some edge cases also like uh, as you can see that the size of that grid is not one minute size of that grid is not n comma n so there can be some cases in which like uh, king is placed just think that our grid is only this one i mean to say meant to say that uh, size of our grid is 8 multiplied with 4 8 by 4 this is size of our grid and if we ask for this one and just think that if our king is placed on here then what we will get or as our response that will be uh, 1 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Okay. So now will we ask for 6 uh, six plus 1, comma 1? Obviously not. Why? Because this is not exiting. Okay, sorry. For 1, comma 7. Because this is not exiting in this grid. So for that, we have to check that is this is in our grid. So for that, uh, First of all, I am asking for 1 comma 1. This is query 1 comma 1. This is a function which I, I have created here. Now for well, if that is 1, that means that is 1. Okay, first of all, I am making plus 1 here. Now if that is 1, that means that is on 1 comma 1. So I am directly outputting that. After that, if well is more than n, then I will not ask for well uh, comma 1. Because this is already more than n. 
and same if that is more than m then i will not ask for one comma will because this is already more than m so for this i am only asking for one comma will and for this i am only asking for will comma will and in this one if that is in less than n as well as less than m then i will ask for both then i'm checking rightly for that and that is the output for this so i hope you all understand it you will get the code in description so see you in the next problem till then have a good one bye bye